Hey, what's up? In this video, I'll be compressing plasma using the magnetic field. This is pretty much eddy currents going through this plasma, and it's formerly known as Z pinch. So, I'm going to be using a step down transformer to generate 30 amps through this coil, and hopefully, that will be enough to compress this plasma. So, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, I'm putting 30 amps to this, and it's really not doing anything to this. So, in order to increase the current, I'm going to try to use my capacitor bank I built in the previous video. Uh, the energy through this capacitor bank is not going to be enough to keep it for very long, so you might just see like a couple of frames. Three, two, one. All right, let's try a different angle. Three, two, one. All right, we're going to the high speed. <laughs> it works. But I'm only getting one frame. <laughs> one frame. Wow. All right, let's try a different one. Let's take two. Uh, that flash is probably going to blind everything, so I can't really see what's going on. Oh, you see it? It's like a little blip. High speed. Just, again, just one frame. Just one frame. That's all you get. But it's working. It's pretty awesome. All right, so I'm going to step up the energy. I'm going to keep these vultures the same, but the energy is going to be around 6,000 joules. Here we go. Three, two, one. High speed. You see it? Please don't tell me there's one frame. And there's one frame. <laughs> Oh man, that explosion though, is that the solder? That plasma beam is pretty awesome. Man, I wish I could have had more frames out of this though. Thanks for watching, this is the preview for my next video. I'm going to place this in the vacuum chamber as well. We'll see what happens. And um, end this video with a bunch of explosions and failed experiments. Enjoy. Bye.